All right, today we're gonna be putting together a two burner gas grill uh, made by Next Grill. Got it at Home Depot. I think it was about 250 on sale. I think they're normally around $299 on, on homedepot.com. But uh, just got this in the garage and I'm gonna do a little time lapse here of putting it together for you. It's pretty simple. Doesn't take too much work to put together. You just follow the instructions. It's pretty simple and anyone can do it. I think all I needed was a screwdriver. So I got the red one. Uh, this is a little bit smaller. Our deck is kind of small and we had a big grill for a number of years so I wanted something with a smaller profile. But I also wanted the gas tank to be on the inside. Um, I hate it when the gas tanks are sitting on the outside. I wanted the door, which costs a little bit of extra money. You can see here this top grill, we, we take that out. Um, we usually just cook steaks or burgers on there. We don't, we don't ever throw it on the cooler to bring the temperature down a little bit. So here I'm gonna bring it in through the house. We don't have any stairs up our deck, so gotta take it in through the house. Now this, there's our dog Sammy. Now this flooring that you're seeing, we've replaced all that. This was back in the summertime. Used to have carpet and linoleum, now it's all hardwood uh, all the way through the whole first level. We're getting ready to sell the house soon, just looking for another property first. And we redone the deck out here and the railing, so we thought it'd be nice to upgrade the grill. And our old one was charcoal, which was nice, but takes a while to heat up. So we switched to propane. Just attaching the propane tank here. I don't know why, but they make these cords so short, you gotta like basically kink it to plug it in. I like to get me a little extension so it's easier to plug it in. Now I have added a level indicator, but uh, it kind of makes it pinch even more, so I need to do something there. As you can see, these arms, they come up to give you some more surface space, but then you can Put those arms down and put the cover on when you're not using it. It takes up way, way less space on the deck. The first grill. Got us a big sirloin steak here. Pop that bad boy on there. Here we got two T-bone steaks. All right, now I'm gonna flip the steaks for the first time and had to turn the heat down. You're gonna see a big flame here. Oh yeah, get the new grill going, baby. Now they say the trick to a perfect steak is you only flip it once. So you gotta leave it on there enough to get, get it seared on the one side, then you flip it let it go for the remaining time and then you gotta be done. Can't be flipping it 14 times, 15 times. No. Sometimes I like to rotate the steak when I'm flipping it and I do flip it twice on both sides. That way I can get the grill lines in like a cross pattern. 
That's only if I'm trying to be fancy. So here we are, eating. Jenna doesn't look like she wants to eat. Oh, I know what she's doing. She's waiting on me to cut up her steak. See a fort back there in the background? Always got something going on with the kids. And if you look really far back there, you can see Tucker sleeping on the couch. We normally have dinner as a family and we wouldn't let him sleep, but he must have been being a brat that day or something. Well, that's the uh, Home Depot Next Grill Deluxe Two Burner Propane Gas Grill in red. Hope you enjoyed.